Hello, in this video we will discuss the concept of native VLAN. So first of all, what is native VLAN? Guys, native VLANs are only supported with dot one q trunks first of all and for native VLAN traffic is always untagged. Like uh, if you remember we have discussed if we have two switches and okay, let me have one more topology. So I explained to you if we have two switches and in between those switches if we have a trunk link switch one will always send information so let's say this is data switch one will always add a tag with the data but if data belongs to native vlan it will always be untagged so there are two things first whenever a switch has to send information and uh, switch knows that let's say native vlan is 10 and traffic is originated from that particular native vlan in that case switch will not tag that particular traffic second if switch is receiving any traffic which is not tagged so switch will assume that traffic belongs to native vlan so there are two things one while sending other while receiving so if i am sending the traffic if traffic is originated from a vlan that is native for the port in that case switch will not tag that particular traffic and if i am receiving an untagged traffic switch will think that it belongs to native vlan by default native vlan is vlan 1 sorry so like i can show you here show interface trunk so in the end you can see native vlan so by default vlan 1 is native vlan on all the switch ports but you can change it let's say in this case i want uh, that vlan 10 traffic should not be tagged so what i will do interface fa0 by 1 switch port trunk native vlan i am changing native vlan to 10 and i will do the same thing on other end of other end also so here i am getting an error also that there is a native vlan mismatch so to resolve the issue i will configure the same native vlan on both the ends so now you can see show interface trunk so which VLAN is native, it means for VLAN 10, traffic will not be tagged. So if I want to make communication possible now, let me delete the previous outputs. Let me try to send traffic again. It is successful, VLAN 10 is successful. If you want to see VLAN 20, it will all be also be successful. But keep this thing in mind for VLAN 10, traffic was not tagged. For VLAN 20, it is tagged. So guys, in this video, we have discussed what is native VLAN and how we can configure it on switch. Thank you.